Olympics, let's explore China's next generation nuclear power technology. Last week, the Chinese Academy of Sciences announced that its 2 megawatt thorium based molten salt reactor in the Gobi Desert region of northern China achieved the world's first thorium to uranium fuel conversion, becoming the only reactor capable of making thorium burn. Thorium based molten salt reactors were proposed by US scientists during the Cold War but was sentenced to death due to complex operational conditions and the inability to rapidly convert to nuclear weapons. The success of Chinese scientists means humanity is one step closer to the next generation of safer, more environmentally friendly nuclear power plants. Considering China's abundant and easily accessible thorium resources, such as the reserves in Byron Herbal in Mongolia, which can supply the country for more than 1,000 years. China is well positioned for long-term energy security. The research push in China began after the Fukushima nuclear disaster in 2011, which drew global attention to nuclear safety. The safety features of thorium reactors led China to invest 22 billion RMB, partnering with over 100 research institutions to tackle the technology. Compared to today's mainstream nuclear power plants that uses Pressurized water reactors, which must shut down regularly to replace fuel rods, operate under extreme high pressure of about 150 atmospheres and produce large amounts of nuclear waste. Thorium-based molten salt reactors, or TMSRs, can run continuously without refueling, operate at a normal pressure and solidify after a leak, making them inherently safer. TMSR's advantage of not needing water for cooling makes it possible to deploy nuclear plants in arid or inland regions. Additionally, the characteristic of TSMRs operating at a normal pressure opens doors to nuclear applications on large vessels and mobile platforms. According to the official timeline, China plans to complete a 100 megawatt thorium based molten salt reactor demonstration plant by 2035, with commercialization expected by 2040. And by 2050, China aims to have 50 thorium reactors nationwide, with a total installed capacity of 50 million kilowatts, meeting 10% of China's electricity demand.